going on guys? Welcome back to Flex Performance. I've uh, been real busy lately, so sorry for not posting a couple of videos lately, but I have been super, super busy in the shop. But here we are, I'm actually on the run right now. I go to Clear Lake Speed. I got I got some parts, some fittings, some fuel lines. Just uh, miscellaneous parts. Was one of the projects that I got going on there at the shop. But um, yeah, no, we've been real busy getting some of the projects that I got going on there finished up. As you can see on my previous video, crawfish is pretty much done. I do have that thing on the dyno right now. I made a couple of passes on it. And that thing is 110% ready to go test. But, it's been real hot right now, so. Beto was like, you know what? Let's wait a little bit. I don't want to be in the truck when it's about 140 degrees outside. So, we're gonna wait a little bit before we take it out. Right now, it's just insane. Especially when you're all suited up for 20, 20 layer suit or 15 layer suit, trying to make passes. It, it, it's just it's super hot. So I did take it apart back again because my boy Juan Serna, he's coming over and picking up all the parts back again because he's going to repolish everything um, just about the same way that we had it before. So. That thing is uh, ready to go. Just wait for him to pick up those parts, get them all sanded down, polished up, and get them back to me so we can get it all put back together. And then uh, that'll be the final assembly. Beto and uh, on the gas crew, they'll, they'll come over and they'll pick it up. Uh, we'll probably make one or two runs on the dyno back again. That way they can get some footage of it. And, uh, because they haven't seen it. But no, everything's working really, really well on it. So, I'm excited. I think, uh, I think that thing's gonna rip. It's, it's, it's got plenty of power. In the meantime, I've been working on the Cutlass and wiring it. And I'm just going over here right now to Clear Lake Speed so I can pick up the rest of the fuel fittings fuel lines and just a bunch of stuff that I ordered for it. Uh, that thing consists of two different fuel systems, one for methanol and one for 93 for street driving. Um, of course, there's a couple other things that we're going to change, like add some seat belts, probably change the seat, maybe put some, some uh, electric windows, you know, as the customer wants to do that. As far as the engine, the engine is pretty much everything ready to go. Uh, we converted it from a carburetor. It's a big block Chevrolet. Uh, converted it from a carburetor blow through to all fuel injection and uh, you know new charge pipe, coil on plug, you name it, all the works. So I've been staying pretty busy in that one. And as you know, Mona Lisa giveaway has ended this past 16 july 16 was the final day for it and i want to thank and appreciate every single body that has bought entries for it tomorrow thursday 20th at 6 p.m central standard time on this youtube channel I am going to go live 6 p.m. Central and we're going to go ahead and do the drawing live here on YouTube so you guys stay tuned on it like and subscribe if you haven't and make sure to go ahead and, and tune on at 6 p.m. when we're going to go live and then we're going to do the drawing afterwards for that one lucky winner and we'll see who will take the truck home and I'm excited I wonder where it's going I don't know I don't know a 
lot of people say that it's going to stay here in Houston. I've got a lot of people saying that it's going to California. Uh, a lot of them are saying that it's going to go to the East Coast. Honestly, I mean, there's no telling. We'll have to see and wait for tomorrow for that one lucky guy or gal. So, remember, 6 p.m. tomorrow uh, on my YouTube channel right here. I am going to go live. And uh, we'll see who's going to be the lucky one. But also, in the meantime, we've been adding some to the shop. Went ahead and, and as, as you remember, the shop is a 40 by 80 building that I just done brand new back in uh, back in November. I built the shop and I've been working on it ever since. Uh, we did some spray foam insulation. We've got an office built, um, and just last week they finished up an added portion to it, which I ended up adding 20 foot by 140 of lean to carport area that way whenever I have cars there you can park in the shade and they're not just outside in the sun or anything like that so we added 20 foot to one side and then which is uh, 20 foot to the front by 100 foot so the total area that we added was a 20 by 140 and it made a big difference it definitely made definitely made a huge difference the office also has been redone quite a bit I went out and I picked up a bunch of old signs like um, fuel signs gas signs it's all retro stuff I, I really like that look and uh, I went ahead and, and got that thing looking pretty good on the outside and on the inside you know it's got a it's got a bar that we added up inside, full blown bathroom, shower, you name it. Um, so it's definitely looking pretty good. The shop is definitely looking pretty good. I mean, I've been upgrading little stuff here and there, but it's still a work in progress. But yeah, no, in the meantime, running around picking up some parts. If you know, you know. Come visit Sheila, Clear Lake Speed. Huh? We made it. No. I thought I was gonna have to send you directions on how to find us. I made it. I've been real busy though. I figured you had Yeah. We're here at Sheila's. That's a good thing. If you know, you know. Just look at all the stuff. You got man if you need parts come over and visit sheila clear lake speed she got you covered but yeah no for sure if you need hey, just me. just look at all the wall i mean i don't think there's not a fitting that you're looking for that she don't have i'm pretty sure she's got everything and if she can't and if she don't have it she'll get it for you yeah that's for sure that's she'll, she'll definitely get it yeah. well you we got we got some parts for me i got a few man you Mar gotta cut the number 20 Oh, that's fine. Parts, parts, and more parts. Mm -hmm. Lugs. We need plenty of spark lugs. What do we got here? Um, oh, some fuel filters. And system one. Yep. Then we got parts. And right here we got the Camaro. This guy's right here will be the next giveaway. 370 cubic inch. Single precision turbo. Nine inch rear end. Mini tub cage. Four lady with a trans brake. Circle D converter. Front, rear brakes, K-member, all tubular suspension in the back. I mean, this thing, this thing's pretty good. I mean, it's got all the, it's got all the bells and whistles. So this will be our next giveaway car. 
I'm gonna do a couple cosmetic stuff on it. Gotta change the lights. Get those, change the lights in the back. Couple things. Like I said, crawfish is done. It's been here in the dyno, but it's been done. Um, I went ahead and took, took the pipes off, covers, crossover, everything's getting polished. So that's why it's taken apart like that. But y'all stay tuned for the next giveaway. I am getting right now an order of shirts, some decals and some merchandise for this. And as soon as we have all that on the store, I will go ahead and go live on this.